All right, welcome back, guys. I'm, uh... I looked up what the problem was. And I don't honestly remember this way of entering the house. This can't be the only way of entering the house. I'm pretty sure there's, like, a f enter the front door way of doing it. But I don't see how you can possibly do it. So there's some, like, uh, weeds and stuff. So you can climb up the weeds. And go this way. I better get out my crossbow. I don't really remember doing that, but, you know, maybe I just have terrible memory. It's quite likely. So let's go see what's going on here. Nope, let's keep going up. We'll go up all the way to the top floor. Got some palm trees, palm trees all around us. A very nice house. <sighs> we're gonna enter in here. Who knows what we're gonna see? Look at this tin foil blocking out all the anything. <laughs> yeah. Very surprising. You're also very dead. There's more of them around, apparently. Very strange look. It looks like blood vessels, doesn't it? Makes sense. We have evil vampires here, so. Like flesh chairs and flesh beds and. Item somewhere around that I want to uh, grab. Let's see it though. We're gonna keep going somewhere. Yeah, that's the item I wanted. Helling rate duration 160%. Yeah, that's the item I was looking for. What is it? I don't really know how or what it is. Oh. Give me my regular armor. I don't know why I keep switching uh, from proper armor to something else. Mummy wrap fetish. Gazing upon this mummified fetish, you feel a rush of vanity. No, sorry, vitality to your undead flesh. Increases passive healing rate by 20%. Alright, well. Let's that's really nice, actually. That's great. I love passing, uh, passive healing rate to increase, but it uh, doesn't really make sense for what was stated over at the top left. It's like 160 something or nothing. What? Those two things aren't <laughs> very well reconciled, I don't think. Anyway, I ain't gonna fuss about it. I found the item I wanted. Whatever it does, I found it, so... Nasty crap here. Seems like a pretty evil house, if I do say so myself. Now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, activate my blood shield. Do a blood strike or something, I don't know. Yeah, 
it's no surprise a bunch of flies here because you have a bunch of rotting flesh hanging around. <laughs> That's one. You know, I'm not gonna use a crossbow when it comes to uh, I get I'm actually in the boss fight. I'm not gonna use a crossbow. I'm gonna use a shotgun. Two dollars there. I just waste two dollars for uh, and shooting at nothing. I didn't even mean to do that. So, also I didn't set my alarm this time, so that's kind of annoying. This whole house is like full of uh, lead soakedness. Go up this way, it's all blocked. Can I unblock it? No, I can't. Probably because it doesn't matter. Let's keep going. <laughs> bye bye. You like being the crossbow in the face? Apparently not. That's weird. What is that? I don't like the look of that. Uh, so, if you didn't get it already, this is a Zemitsi uh, haven, I think. And the Zemitsi are all about uh, flesh crafting. Where they take uh, living beings. And, uh... All right, I'm gonna save right here. I'm gonna save this because... Uh... Because uh, I already know this is going to be a boss fight. And it sh probably will be a tough fight. Although uh, my past remembrances aren't always indirect. My past remembrances aren't always in direct agreement with. Uh, with that, what actually happens? So there's no reason to do the thing like that. No, no reason to sneak anymore. What is that smell? Corset Tremier, blood hangs heavy on the air. Young too, squirming larva of the wretched brood who stole their immortality. Tell me, child, are you scared? Do I frighten you? Is my knowledge of you unnerving? So I'm Tremere. He said I stole his immortality, and what you know? Well, I didn't, you know, personally. Uh, but yeah, uh, the Tremere got their uh, their stuff from another vampire. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end the video here because I know I've been doing it for a little while and I didn't save, I didn't start my timer so I don't know how much time has actually elapsed 
and I don't want to go over, you know, 25, you know, 20 minutes is what I'm aiming for, but I don't want to go over, tw like, 25 minutes. I think I've been doing it for a little while, maybe 10, 15 minutes, which isn't enough time. What I'm going to do is I'm going to quit this video, I'm going to start the next, and, uh... I'm going to go ahead and start the timer to make sure I don't go, over, go, go overboard. But basically, when he says stolen immortality, what he means is that the initial, the guy, Tremere, he, uh, he, di he diablerized one of the 13 ancients, you know, one of the 13 antediluvians. He, he diablerized one of them. So, uh, I don't know. It's a stolen thing because it was diablerized. Anyway, I'll see you all, I'll see you all next time. See you then. We'll start right where we left off.